the business end of it, um, you know, you, you know pretty much if you want to do this that you like kids and you like spending time with kids. Most providers have children of their own and they're looking for a way to still continue to work but be with their own children. And I knew nothing about running a business. And taking care of the kids was, that was a piece of cake. Um, but as far as running the business went, that was really, um, I had no experience at all. I didn't know about dealing with income taxes. I didn't know about um, hiring someone, which I eventually did. I didn't know all the responsibilities that would come with that. I didn't even know how to keep the records. And, you know, just kind of tried, oh, I can do that, you know, no problem, I can fill those forms out. And it was really hard, and I got myself into a lot of paperwork issues and troubles when I first started out. Well, when I started 26 years ago, I was a family child care provider, but I really felt like I was a babysitter. Um, and I wish I had known to have a contract and have all the guidelines right in place before I even started. That um, there were a lot of things that parents kind of would like to know before they even approach the business. So I guess that's the biggest advice I'd have, have is just, you know, compare notes with other child care providers and have a guideline so that you know what your expectations are and the parents can know what your expectations are. Uh, some of the things I wish I had known was how much work it is, how it, the day really doesn't end when the kids leave. It really entails a lot. I think it depends on, you know, the number of children you have. But having, I have a large program, so my day runs six to six, and then I have a lot of paperwork and things to do after hours. So I would say that's the most part. I guess I didn't realize how much time I'd be putting into it, um, and that I figured I'd be home with my kids, but I'm really doing other stuff, and so, you know, the, the time I thought I would have, I don't have. <laughs> I'm busy doing uh, planning for the next day, or cleaning up, or uh, scheduling a meeting, or things like that, so.